you guys doing? This is very important in reverence to the crimes of government and their false investigations of intrusiveness and their slander. We need all the information of which people have falsified investigations where they had kidnapped me from California and these people had kidnapped me from my mother and father's mansions. Did you claim that was an investigation of you people trying to investigate me, government? You trespassed on my mother and father's property. You must get charged and prosecuted from the first day you ever did it. Another thing of importance, these government people are blocking social media and people that are friendly with me that wouldn't harass me or be trying to slander my character or slandering my genetics. They're blocking people that know me that are celebrities or directors or writers or producers or cinematographers that are, you know, friends of mine that have known me for a long time. There has to be lawsuits against the government for the government trying to censor and blocking me from having contact with friends that tried to call me. People can't get through on the phone. People can't even send email. People can't even send uh, messages. And that motherfucker just said, oh, he thought you threatened the president. Never had an interest in the president. Never even talked to him. The man that made this shit up must face the death penalty. And every president that has been stalking me, if their name is on the hate club list, they must get arrested. The documents of the hate club list are usually court cases against ethnicities of certain individuals, such as Germans, political families that would try to steal the wealth of my family. Any perpetrators, any people that's crossed the line to try to hurt me or damaged anything on my body or, or tried to rape me, anybody of their families or any of their relatives, must get prosecuted. The restraining orders are the highest restraining orders in the world. So in reference to politician and uh, Germans, somebody just communicated, they said, well, this man thinks this man wanted to investigate you for his FYI. You wanted to investigate somebody. Are you a German? And you tried to investigate Jews and Catholics. You have no legal grounds to stand on. Do you understand what that fucking means? You tried to create an investigation to steal my sperm and genetics? You get the death penalty. You thought you'd create an investigation to try to investigate me, to block me from my birthrights? I'm not illegitimate. I'm the only child of my parents. Any child that I would have would be illegitimate. Any child I'd have with any female, they're all illegitimate. Do you understand that? It even says that on treasury documents. Now, in reference to the government and their crimes of voyeurism and their crimes of physical assault, they must get prosecuted. See, all children would be illegitimate for the protection of my ownership of the estates of my parents forever. And it is documented in reference to any prenup, too. So in reference to government people or government people illegally censoring people that are nice people or friendly people or fans of mine, that's illegal censorship. And there has been government people posing as fans that have tried to murder me, that have stolen from me, such as monies or gifts that people might have sent. Those people have to get prosecuted. I have nothing to do with that shit. In reverence to people, such as organizations, or like the, the Teamsters tried to send something to me, and this man stole it, claiming he was trying to do an investigation. You, you thought you'd conjure up shit? Any man that's been found guilty of stealing my sperm has to get arrested, or any genetics at all. So in reverence to these government men 
these people claiming they thought they could just create an investigation because they wanted to get into somebody's life. Well, the laws of Elliot Ness tell you you're not allowed to get into my life, government man. They tell you you're not allowed to trespass. They say you don't have a right looking, even if you fabricated a warrant. Do you understand that, government man? You're a German, aren't you? You claimed you're an American. You claimed you owned more in this country than my parents? See, there is a level of clout and status of wealth and ownership that does not allow people to pry into a person's life. And don't forget, my parents own some police stations in America. You understand that, government man? And you are a German Nazi, right, government man? You got into government and hid your identity as a Nazi thief by wearing a police uniform, didn't you? And then the Nazis posed as medical people for Jews and Catholics and French and Italians and Asians and other people to steal genetics, didn't you? You get prosecuted for your German uh, falsifications and your German illegal manipulations of laws. I don't have a German doctor. I'm not allowed to have a German doctor of any kind. You claimed you were on security and you were a German that tried to rape me? You were a German trying to block me from my mother and father's property? That means you're trying to claim you thought you owned things that I'm the owner of. Or things that my parents owned. Is that not true, government man? You say things like, or you've communicated things like, they've communicated saying, oh, after these lawsuits. No, no, there, there ain't no after these lawsuits. You already trespassed. But we want to hear what kind of shit you say, because the more you say, the bigger the lawsuits get against you. And against the government. I have not received any of the lawsuits from anywhere. And I have not received any of the insurance money from my mother and father's life insurance policies. My father got murdered over 40 years ago, someone might say. Then my father was frozen. Do you understand the situation, government man? You thought you would false profile somebody from a high class and a high education. And you thought your lies, you thought they were good enough to do the harmful things and criminal things and sexual abuse and mutilation things that you made up in your fucking brain. You faced the death penalty for damaging things on my anatomy and stealing my genetics. I'm not your child, I'm not your property, I'm not your race, I'm not your religion, you're not my friend. Any genetic theft, they must get prosecuted. Any physical assault, they must get prosecuted. Any trespassing, they must get prosecuted. These people have never had a warrant, not even from the first day. Then they kidnapped me and held me hostage and made up lies. They tried to rape me every time. There's even medical people that's tried to rape me. They face the fucking death penalty. I'm not your child. I'm not your property. I'm not your race. I'm not your religion. And your government agents need to get arrested for your fucking crimes.